Hi and uh, welcome to this next uh, video tutorial um, in which uh, you will learn how to install VS Code or Visual Studio Code to develop your applications with Dart. If you don't have uh, Dart installed yet, please have a look at my uh, last video in which I have explained how to install Dart. You might ask now why not Android Studio or IntelliJ? Well, because not all frameworks are supported that Start has to offer and which you might want to use. I don't like to switch between editors, so I like to use the same for everything and uh, VS Code is a really good uh, choice uh, to do that. VS Code is rather classified as a code editor and not the fully integrated IDE. So there will be some uh, command line typing, but it's not that much. And uh, VS Code has at least all the features that uh, I need to uh, develop my applications with that. Now to install VS Code, you can go onto the code.visualstudio.com uh, website. I will just open it up so that's the website that's the url and uh, then here you can uh, download the version for mac it should be auto selected otherwise if you scroll down you can uh, choose the uh, binary that you need the, the installation binary uh, once you have downloaded it uh, it will be a zip file that was downloaded and if you uh, click on it and unzip it what you will get is this uh, Visual Studio binary which you then can uh, just move into your applications folder. I will not do that now because I have it already and then you can just uh, place it here. So I will not do that now because I have it already. So once this is uh, complete, then you can just um, go into the Applications folder, search for the Visual Studio Code uh, application and start it. And that's how it should look like uh, once you have uh, loaded it. Now, uh, to get it ready to have uh, color coding, code formatting, debugging options and things like that for Dart. You will need to install some extensions, which is uh, quite easy as well. So you just click onto the code, onto code above here. Then you can go into preferences extensions. And then you can just search for Dart. You will see quite a lot of extensions that are uh, loaded here, but the ones you need is this uh, Dart uh, extension. So just uh, make sure that you install this. You should have an install uh, button just up here. And what you can also do is you can install the Flutter uh, extension. You should also have an install button here, which will uh, enable all the uh, Flutter uh, features inside uh, VS Code. And so once you have done that, uh, you should be finished already. So uh, now you should be ready to start uh, coding with whatever uh, Dart framework you want to use. I hope this tutorial was useful. If I missed something or if you are stuck somewhere then uh, just post in the comments box below and I will try to help you as good as I can. Okay, thank you very much. Have a good day. Bye bye.